thank you all for coming out. Before we get started, we want to take a couple moments to talk about why we're out here and why CRM and Bray put on this event. First, we want to bring awareness to our career field. One National EOD Day, which was designated by Congress in 2010, to be on the first Saturday in May. Second, to bring awareness to the EOD Warrior Foundation, a nonprofit organization that's provided our community with a lot of resources and a lot of great support over the past 10 years. Third, and finally, to memorialize our UD brothers and sisters that made the ultimate sacrifice. to go for PJs, like a good few of us, um, I actually found EOD and I don't look back on it. It's the best family I ever had. When I went to the recruiter and uh, as I was looking through the different jobs, it just, it seemed super cool. Just went with it. Got lucky the whole way. I get handed a list of jobs, and I hand them a list of jobs back. And she was like, no, 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 that's not how this works. And I was like, no, I've been studying, like, this is the jobs I want. She's like, no, you pick from this list. And uh, <laughs> so I'm sitting next to my buddy, and I'm like, hey, man, how much for me to do EOD? He was like, oh, no balls, you won't. And I was like, number one choice. And uh, next week, they were like, here's your orders. You're going to Shepherd. You're going to be an EOD tech. Yeah. <laughs> 